Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and this lab is just recently updated. So here is the updated solution for this lab. So first of all, just log in with your credentials and once you're done with this, now just simply come over here and search for the BigQuery. Open the BigQuery over here, just wait. Okay, then click on this untitled. Now in description box, I will share one GitHub link. Just open that link and you are able to access this all this query. And I already configured query for you according to task. Now what you have to do, just copy this first query of task number one, paste over here. Now go back to your lab instructions and just check the date. Okay, just simply come on the task number one. And here you can see for me, the month is April and date is 25. So for you, it might be changed. So just change accordingly. So April means fourth month and date is five. So what you have to do, just change over here like 4 and date is 25 so I'm not going to change the date just simply click on run and once the query is executed we will get a score without any issue as you can see query is completed if I just simply click on check my progress I will get a score without any issue now come back over here copy the task number 2 query replace the query over here again go back to your okay let me just adjust this okay now come back over here and as you can see we got a score for task number one now here what they said we had to just change the ratio so just copy this number come over and paste over here now what is the date is 25th april so just come over here and here you can see month is already chosen for me so i'm just going to change the date so 25th okay now just again click on run just wait and the query is completed now if you just simply come over here and click on the check my progress you will get a score without any issue now come back over here copy the task three query replace the query over here like this now again go back to your lab instructions and as you can see we got a score for task number two now here we have to again change the limit so just copy this make the changes now again check the date so it's 25th april so month is already chosen for me so i'm just going to change the date okay like this again click on run once the query is executed if i just come over here and click on check my progress i will get a score without any issue now again come back to task number four and here as you can see i already add one note so read that note carefully okay just copy this query make the changes over here now come back over here and as you can see for me the month is june and in june month there are 30 days so what we have to do so we have to just change the date to 30 and it's june month so we have to just change to six like this okay for you if it's april so then you have to change to four then if it's may then you have to just change to five like this okay we have done with all the changes if i just simply click on run and come back over here and click on check my progress i will get a score without any issue then come back over here copy the task number five query again replace the query over here click on run no no sorry what we have to do First of all, we need to come over here and we have to just change the limit also. So just come over here, just change the limit and then click on run. And once you click on run, if you just simply come over here and click on check my progress, we will get a score without any issue. Okay, now come on the task number six. So just come over here, copy this query. Okay, make sure you copy query carefully like this okay come back over here replace the query then again go back to your lab instructions and then check for me it's 21st of feb and what is the last date is 12th of march so here you can see just come over here so just make the changes 21st of feb and 13th of march 12th of march okay 12th of march so just come over here make the changes like this now just wait once the query is completed click on this run and it's done now I just simply come over here go and check my progress we will get a score without any issue now again scroll down copy the task number seven query carefully okay like this come back over here replace this query again go back to your lab instructions and here we have to just change the percentage for me it's 20 percent so just simply come over here make the changes to 20 and click on run and once the query is executed we will get a score click on check my progress and we will get a score over here now come back to the copy this query till last like this now come back over here make the changes again again go back to your lab instructions and here you can see we have to again change the limit so just simply come over here and just change the limit to 20 
and if you just simply click on run we will get the score on task number eight without any issue now again go back to your github repo copy this query for task number nine again make the changes now come back to your lab instructions and what is the date is 25th april so just simply come over here and as you can see this date the second date so just april means fourth month and what is the date is 25th okay once you're done with these changes click on run and once the query is executed we will get a score on task number nine without any issue okay now again come back to and copy the last query of this task just copy this replace the previous query done okay come back to your lab instruction and as you can see we got a score for task number nine as well now what you have to do here you can see date range so for me is third 29 so what we have to do third 29 like this and what is the ending date is 427 so 427 like this just wait we got a green tick click on run and here please pay attention because this is the last task query what we have to do just let me just click on this explore data then click on this explore data with lucas today just wait click on get start and as you can see you got a, this kind of output once you get this kind of output just simply click on check my progress you will get a score without any issue and that's the way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please let me know in the comment section guys thanks for watching and have a good day